everyone. My name is Thomas Feske and I represent Cavli Wireless. Cavli Wireless is a US-based company that design and manufacture cellular IoT modules. In this video, I'm going to show you a value proposition, how to onboard and activate Cavli modules in less than one minute, and I'm going to show you briefly our Cavli Hubble platform. At Cavli Wireless, we provide the three main building blocks of IoT the cellular IoT module, the connectivity, and the Cavliable platform. For the cellular IoT module, we provide a range of LT and LP1 modules. For example, I have here with me two modules. The first one is the C1RM module that can provide NB IoT and 2G fallback. The second one I have is the c am module that can provide LT Cat1 connectivity and 2G fallback. All of our IoT modules have ECM inside and we provide an extensive coverage for IoT connectivity around the globe. These three main building blocks have been bundled into one package called the Humble 99. Now let me show you how to quickly onboard and activate a Cavli module into our platform. For that, I will use an EVK of Citadel. To onboard and activate a device, we have to follow three different steps. The first step is to log in inside the platform and create a group of devices. So I'm going to show you right now how to create this group of devices. So once you enter the platform, you have to go inside the group feature. Here you have to click on the create a new group. For example, in my case, I'm going to create the group called c 10 am EVK test and write the description also. I save here and so now I have created the group of devices. For the second step, we have to collect three different parameters to be able to register the device remotely thanks to, a, to an IT command called AT plus Hubble Rig. Those three parameters are the account ID, the data plan ID, and the group ID. Now for the third step, I'm going to show you how to send an AT command directly to register the device into the platform. So for that, I'm just going to show you quickly what is the status of the device with the AT command called AT plus Hubble Rig. As you see now, the device is unregistered. So what we have to do is send the AT command with the two parameters that we have created before, which are the account ID, data plan ID and the group ID. So those are the two parameters that we have collected recently. I'm going to set it right now. Now let's talk about the Cavli Hubble platform. When you go on the homepage, you can see on the left side of the panel that there is six different features. The first one is the dashboard, where you can see all the activities on your device globally. The second one is the inventory, where you can list all the devices that you have in your platform. The third one is the group of devices that you have recreated recently. The fourth one is the device management, when you can manage remotely your device one by one. The fifth one is how to manage your data plan. And the last one is about the messaging services. Let's talk about a bit more about the device that we have recently opened. If you go inside the device management feature, you have to open the group that we have created before, which is called the Citadel EVK test. In this one, we have one line where we can see that this device has been connected to the Spanish network, where I am sitting right now, and we have been connected to Vodafone network. I can see that there is more than 50 parameters available about the device and the network, such as the clock time, RSSI, signal strength, PSM status, e-direct status, etc. And finally, let's talk about the admin panel. You can see on top of the screen the access to all the firmware updates that you have here. You can also interact with the R&D directly. You can also download our documentation about our modules and solutions. You can also access to the store and order other modules from us. And you can also have access to notifications. If you want to configure the account, you have to go on this image here and click on the View Account 
and then to configure your profile, your billing, your settings, if you want to activate your messaging services or your API, you can also have access to your orders and to your different transactions. Thank you so much, everyone. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, just contact us.